Well, Garn folk, I done did it again. In the desert, there is life. Not sure what the botanical name of this cactus is, but man, the blooms are definitely huge. Thanks to uh, this cactus juice, bone meal. Do I have bone meal? I don't. And just a whole lot of love. Here's my operation now. I did get the backyard I was hoping for. I didn't get the next door um, grant or whatever, but you know, things keep rolling. So these are all my plants I got going. Those are future free plants. I got Roma tomatoes, jalapeno peppers that are almost ready. I want them to be a bit bigger. This is just all the stuff that's part of the biz. Got some trees, got a whole bunch of moringa that's going out for you guys. So, you know, things keep going, the world keeps turning and, uh, you know, never gonna stop. Can't stop, won't stop, as they should say. So, you know, early bird gets to worm, no work, no reward. So just keep on pushing. So I'm just bragging about what I got going. See my adenium is flowering. Just kind of giving some springtime vibes here in AZ. It's already warm. And we're definitely in the 80s, I think. I just haven't even checked the temperature, but it sure is warm. Warm enough for everything to grow, warm enough for things to start flowering. Um, kind of a mess right now. I'm in the midst of making concrete pots and potting up stuff. But uh, don't forget, right now is the best time to feed all your plants. Keep the water pumping, because remember, as plants are growing, they want more water. The water, not only is it to keep them alive, but the more water there is, it's just gonna grow faster. I'll explain the science behind that, but if they don't have enough water and they're actively trying to grow, they are gonna close their stoma, which is gonna hold back carbon intake, which is gonna slow down growth. So right now, springtime, temperatures are in the 80s and 90s. You wanna keep watering, keep feeding, and then when the summer creeps around, I know this is going to sound weird, but when summer creeps around, you actually maybe just want to introduce some shade and hold back on midday watering because when temperatures get up there in the hundreds, plants um, tend to shut down to conserve water, which means they're not drinking water, so don't overwater your plants. But back to the main show right here, you know, if you're looking to get some cactus to start flowering, get this guy combine it with some bone meal and don't get don't get uh overboard with it and overwater too much you still gotta let these things dry out but man oh man i am impressed i wasn't gonna do a video but i seen this and had to do a video there's some things that also some things i'm bringing back forgot what this is i think a coleus bringing it back so don't forget i mean stuff can live out in the sun, but it does better with a little bit of shade. Over and out, garden folk.